What's up guys, my name is Andrew and today we're going to do some more Overwatch cases, not the game. But before we get into that, I want to announce the winner of this Frostside Misty Field Tested giveaway. I've actually kind of grown to like it. I've been using it in game and it actually looks pretty good. So congratulations to whoever wins this. Let's go to the winner page. All right, here we are, Gleam.io, 1,197 entries. That's a lot. Uh, okay, so we're going to go to this winners page right here and we're going to draw one winner out of everybody. Uh, boom. Let's do it. And there we go. The winner is going to be Emil Ma... That person. <laughs> Sorry, I can't pronounce names. I'm really bad at it. But I have your uh, I have your email address, which I'll probably blur out in the uh, in the in the video. I'll I'll email you and ask for your information for Steam, and then I'll send it over, and everyone will have a good day. Congratulations! If you didn't win, next time maybe. Best of luck. <laughs> Not everybody can win. I don't have that many AKs. All right, here we go. CT side. It's round 23, so we're kind of in the middle of the game. Anything can happen. It's 11-11. This guy's got a headshot of 83% on 6 kills and 75% on 12 kills. Let's see what's going on. He's got pretty decent ping. He's top fragging. Uh, let's see how this plays out. Do we have our walls on? Actually, no, we don't, do we? How do we turn our walls on? There it is. Okay, so it looks like the T's are doing some sort of mid to B push right here. And uh, it should have been called out at this point. I just missed a couple shots there. He's still checking that long. Kind of afraid someone's going to go there. It's a 2v2. This should be called out though. Because he should have seen two people oh. running up. But I guess not. Killed by an opper. Hey, when that happens. There's no terrorists coming through long. They're all going up cat it looks like. One will actually come through long, it looks like, actually. He's going to rotate back to site to help out Diamond. He's shooting at that guy, but I think he can see his gun, can't he? I don't know, I can't tell. Can you see his gun? Maybe, yeah, yeah, he sees it, right? There it is. Or maybe if he didn't see his gun. I think he saw his gun, but if he didn't, a teammate could have said, there's one right in that little corner. Woo! Woo! going to throw a flashbang to flash that dude. It did work, but he's going to miss the guy on site with him. Yeah, not, not a very good take for him. Oh, here we go. The T's are going long. We get to see something here. Oh, he dodges two flashes. Dang. This guy's good at dodging flashes. It's one. He's, he shot a little bit too much for that guy. <clears throat> All right, here's... Oh, misses the chance for another one. All right, we're about to see a little bit of action here on Cat. <laughs> he doesn't get the kills. Do you guys see anything? I don't see anything with this guy. He missed an op right there. There's an op down in CT. <laughs> oh, one of them gets picked through mid. That's not going to be good for the round. Looks like all the T's are going towards B site, which should be called out right now. Except for one who's still hiding uh, in T. There's going to be a guy coming from T spawn. Oh, which he did here with his ears. And then there is one. Yeah, this one rushing him right here. He can't aim this dude. Alright, we're gonna have three T's pushing up on uh, on Cat here. Oh, he's gonna get one in the head. And the others are gonna fall back. Okay, it's a 2v1 right here. They're obviously gonna go B. Because they know the last guy is on A. So here we go. Oh, that was. Whoa. That was crazy. <laughs> and the other guy, the other guy. To the oh, he sees him. And he hits him in the head. Some of these shots don't look like they're actually aimed at his head. But I haven't seen enough of them to actually judge whether or not it's like an unnatural flick or whether he's just hitting the headshot. If anything, this guy would have aim hacks. Not wall hacks, because he's, he's, um, he's, he, I mean, he has no idea where they are usually. He would have aim hacks because some of those, uh, some of those scout shots look like they're aimed at the body and, the, and he hits the head. And also, he shoots a bit too much. Okay. Now we're seeing a little bit more here. At this point, I think he might he might be aim hacking here. Because just with those scout shots alone, and what I was about to say is he's shooting a little bit too much for kills. Uh, like Kind of like he's expecting his aimbot to do the work, you know? Alright, that round's over. Please don't be the last round. Give me one more. Give me one more. Give me one more. Okay, one more here. This will be the last round of the game. 
please do some stuff, otherwise I'm not entirely sure. I think he's I think he's aiming though. Aim hack. Cause like look at his headshot ratio, that's really high. Especially for his level, which has gotta be around uh like silver something. I don't know, I'm level four. And so when I do overwatches, doesn't that mean that it's like it's gotta be lower than my rank, I think? Like I don't think they give me a global elite to I mean, okay, he doesn't seem to have very good game sense that, like, he seems to be a low rank, but his, his, uh, his aim is on point, this dude. Alright, it's a 2v3, maybe we'll get to see some more true colors here. Okay, he's gonna hear one going B, and there's gonna be one coming mid as well. Let's see how he deals with that. A headshot. Dude, this, how? <laughs> I think he's aim hacking. Oh, that was a voice crack. I think he's aim hacking here. Okay, the other guys are on B here. Okay, he knows, he knows the last one's there because he's shot a couple shots. Okay. I think at this point, it's it's fairly certain. I mean, either he's really... Because he doesn't seem to be at a, a high rank. Uh, just with how he's playing and how the enemies are playing as well. They seem to be a low rank, like um, Silver something. So either he's a smurf and he knows his aim or something, or he's aim hacking. I think he's aim hacking. So I'm going to say uh, that it's evident that he is aim hacking because those scout shots... It doesn't look like he was aimed at their head. It looked like he was aimed at their body, and somehow he got the headshot. Um, and then the the sprays as well. It's not easy to get a headshot uh, in the middle of a spray, unless you really know your spray pattern. But from his playing, I don't think that's the case. I think he uh, he had some sort of aim hacks here there that were um, were helping him with those headshots. Uh, I don't think he was vision assist. I don't think he was using external assistance, um, and I don't think he was griefing as well. Here we go, Overwatch! Let's go, it's warm-up. It's not often that I get to Overwatch a warm-up. See what happens early game. You can tell a lot about a person in warm-up. Not really. People are usually warm-up warriors. That's what I always say. Like, if I get wrecked by the, uh, the opposing team in warm-up, I'm always like, no, they're warm-up warriors. Because people in warm-up play completely different than people in game. And it's often hilarious how, how many times I've had enemies that are pros in warm-up, but, like, suck in game. And it's, it's always funny. Fast forwarding. Here we go. He's going with the Deagle. I started taking a liking to the Deagle. I wonder if this is me. It could be. Who knows? Alright. He's jumping around. Head sh headshot. Headshot. Come on. The Deagle's a difficult gun to kind of like... I mean, it's one of the... It's a one-shot gun, so... In the head. So, it's one that aimbotters really like to use. Right, he's missed his first shot here. Ooh, his teammate got him. Looks like they're going to do a full rotate B here because the whole enemy team is on A. Ooh, he's playing around this guy, actually. That's a bit... That's a bit interesting. He's ba he's not good with the Deagle. I don't know why he's chosen to use the Deagle. Uh, at this point, I think he might have walls just because of that initial play, but I'm not going to say immediately. Ooh, nice shot, dude. All right, here we go. He's going to go for the... Ooh, this is always a telling one. I right, missed the shot. Not fast enough. Let's see what he does. <laughs> T side has completely taken over B site, but it's only two on there, and the other two are still in T spawn doing their thing. That was kind of weird how he. It, it was almost like he knew the guy would be passing behind the door, so he didn't bother shooting at the guy in front of door that he could actually see. That was a bit interesting. I noticed this guy's here, he saw his gun, and he heard him kill his teammate. Uh. So that's going to be the last guy right there with the shotgun. He gets the headshot. All right, he's going to go into suicide and then pre-aim mid here. Okay, now that was a good shot. A bit fast. There's another one. Okay, this this shooting through mid is not very... T See, I always thought it doesn't look like he's using wall hacks from the shooting in mid because if he were using wall hacks, usually he would be right on point. He'd know exactly when they're crossing and he'd be able to hit them right when they cross. But here he's actually trying to flick into the like into the door to hit them, which is how people who don't wall hack try and hit those shots. Okay, he's gotten one right there, but he knew where he was kind of because his teammates were shooting at him. All right, he's pre-aiming everything here. He's gonna smoke the cross. Not a very good one, I might add. Oh wait, but maybe he's not trying to cross though. Little exchange of fires there. 
It looks like he's gonna retreat. Whoop! That shot was very slow. Maybe he saw the guy was naming at him and was like, I'm gonna take my time here. It's a smoke grenade. I do that too. Like, I'm really bad about determining what is a smoke grenade. Oh, there's one right there. Let's see, the guy's behind a uh, box. He's kind of pre-aiming these dudes, but maybe it's just coincidence. And he's like pre-aiming the common spots, maybe. They just need to get on site and plant that thing, man. Shoot that guy. Oh! Oh, does he have time, though? Oh, so close. All right, let's see what he does. He's gonna aim mid. See, you see what I'm talking about? Like, he's kind of tracked that guy a little bit. I wish I could fat, or I wish I could rewind to watch that again. That actually looked like he, he tracked him through the wall a little bit. We should have at least four more rounds here that we can check. Oh, there's one on Cat. You should have seen him by now. Maybe missed him. One, one's gonna peek mid. Oh. And now one is peeking. Oh, he just saw him. <clears throat> There's one. Didn't look like a, a wall hack shot though. All right, this team's pushing up long right now. There's gonna ha they're gonna have uh, contact cat. Contact cat, shoot him with bullets and stuff. Oh, he's in ninja. Okay, he's throwing the nade right at him. But maybe his teammate said he's in ninja, so he's like, okay. Oof. I don't know how he didn't. I, I don't know how he didn't know he was there. The teammates called him out and he threw a nade at him and, and everything. Oh, he's pushing close, pushing close, pushing close. And he's gonna get the final kill there. I'm still unsure. If anything, he's wall hacking. He's not aim hacking, he's not griefing, and he's not jumping around with b-hop scripts or anything. Um, if anything, it would be wall hacking, but I still haven't seen that much evidence. There's just been a, a few shreds of evidence that, I'm, that I've seen. But uh, as always, it could just be coincidence. I mean, everyone every once in a while makes a crazy shot through door or something. Bomb is pushed into lower tons. I'm thinking this is a silver game as well, because bombs should never push alone into lower tons, like that. He, he should know where the guy is. What is this? See, okay, this is another piece of evidence, because it kind of looks like he's trying to hide the fact that he does have walls. Because look at this, he knows where the guy is, unless his teammate's not calling out. He hears bullets being shot, he should know exactly where the enemy is. But instead, he's pre-firing other corners and aiming somewhere else that the enemy's not. So that kind of looks like he's trying to hide it, but again, it could just be a lack of communication or something like that. He's on B site. There's no enemies on B site. He's checking every corner, pre-firing a little bit. Oh, 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 oh. Can't aim with anything. It's actually kind of hilarious. There we go. Last two enemies are on A site. He's checking corners. He's checking like every corner. Gets that shot right there. A nice flick, if I may say so myself. Last guy's on cat. He should know exactly where he is. Let's see if he still checks corners. <laughs> Look at the they're full ops. They all have ops. This is not gonna be good. Okay, here we go. There's a guy jumping. How did you not pre-aim that area? Is that's gonna be our last one, isn't it? Oh no, okay. Um, he's not aiming, he's not other stuff. Oh, I don't know. I'm gonna watch that again. Okay, I've gone over what I recorded and I think the guy was walling. Um, there were a couple of subtle things that he did at first. Well, the first round was completely blatant. He, it, it would look, it looked like he was tracking everybody through the wall and he knew where everybody was. Um, and I don't think that's coincidence. I think, I think he was actually just going crazy there and uh, just using his walls flat out. Then the next round, he kind of cleared up a little bit. There were still a couple of, uh, of subtle things that he did. Um, and then towards the end, of course, it really looked like he was overcompensating for uh, for knowing where the people were. It looked like he was trying to show that he didn't know where they were. There were instances where um, 
At one point, he's pushing up A. His teammates clearly saw someone go into Ninja. He threw a nade right at that guy in Ninja, and then he gets onto site, and he doesn't even worry about the guy who's Ninja. He just worries about the guy who's Cat and pretends not to even know that the guy is Ninja. And it it it's very it, it seems clear that he knew that the guy was there uh, beforehand, and he's trying to play it off that he didn't know where he was. And then later, of course, he does a couple things where he knows exactly where the enemy is because he hears gunshots. His teammates would have definitely called it out. Um, and yet he's still pre-firing other corners uh, to make sure he's not there. And this it's only 1v4 or something. So there there are a couple of things that I think make it clear that he is hacking and trying very hard to show that he's not. So I'm going to say it's evident beyond reasonable doubt. What do you guys think in the comments? Uh, was he hacking? Was he not? Did he have walls? Or was he just not a very good player and I read that completely wrong? Who knows? Uh, comment down below. Hit that like button if you like the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one.